And I've seen the promised land. I may not get there with you, but I want you to know the night that we as a people will get to the promised land. So I'm happy tonight. I'm not worried about anything. I'm not fearing any man. Mine eyes have seen the glory of the coming of the Lord. Words, English words, but full of echoes, memories, associations. They've been out and about on people's lips, in their houses, in the streets, in the fields so many centuries. Timorous 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. All three engines up and burning. 2, 1, 0, and liftoff, the final liftoff of Atlantis on the shoulders of the space shuttle. America will continue the dream. The program, Houston. Roger roll, Atlantis. What's life? Um, magazine. Magazine? You're supposed to say how much. Oh, oh, how much? Oh, how seven cents. Seven cents. No say, I've only got, no got say, I've only got six. Oh, I only got six cents. That's tough. What's tough? Life. What's life? A magazine. You ask what is our policy? I will say it is to wage war by sea, land and air with all our might with all the strength that God can give us. To wage war against a monstrous tyranny never surpassed in the dark and lamentable catalogue of human crime. That is our policy. You ask, what is our aim? I can answer in one word, victory. You, old woman, blessed with blindness, can speak the language that tells us what only language can, how to see without pictures. Language alone protects us from the scariness of things with no names. Language alone is meditation. If I should have a daughter, instead of mom, she's going to call me point B, because that way she knows that no matter what happens, at least she can always find her way to me. And I'm going to paint the solar systems on the backs of her hands. So she has to learn the entire universe before she can say, oh, I know that like the back of my hand. And she's going to learn that this life will hit you hard in the face, wait for you to get back up just so it can kick you in the stomach. But getting the wind knocked out of you is the only way to remind your lungs how much they like the taste of air.